Alright folks, morning, morning. We saw the bridge and again the original should be go the bushman here. Right now I'm heading on a mission to Granville Beach. We're going out with the kayak. And well kayak fishing, I'm going to meet my bridge in Lincoln Blackman. And we're going out there and do something. Well, this could be the first ever vlog on YouTube about kayak fishing on Granville. The first fishing video actually on YouTube because I type up fishing Granville and nothing come up. Yeah, so we go and do it. So if you all want to see how fishing in Granville is like kayak fishing or fishing, look at this video and yeah. Anyway, and it's 4 a.m. and heading out and you know when people see this vlog they might say boy yeah check my yeah check my boy yeah check them the cargo the cargo absolutely or the cargo there's only one man I put a count on to move with me this hour yeah but I mean he's not wrong I ain't seen him around he probably are wrong but I uh, you know yeah and next man that go with me is Shaggy yeah yeah, but he far. Yeah, so um, that's about it. So stay tuned and let me see what we're going down in Granville. Yeah, we're going to pick up Lincoln in a bit. Lincoln kayak, Kaidong. Lincoln might join me around 8 9. And we'll see how it goes. Yeah, so stay tuned. Alright, folks, on my way to pick up Lincoln. Oh lord, I had to vlog this. Boy, outside here, like a deep freeze. What? It cool. Fog in the air. Papa out my hand outside it freeze. Yeah. But the fog coming and going. Anyway. Yeah, I'm on my way to pick up Lincoln, so stay tuned. Alright folks. Nice. So we come to pick up Lincoln here. Lincoln already yet. I head in long road and he could come later. So right about now we want to highlight something in what is the name of this road? Bodai Street. Bodai Street off Block Road in La Fortune Village. La Romaine. La Romaine, right. We want to highlight this arm. Um, this tomb here in the middle of the road. Yeah, check it out. So they say. Alright. Yeah, they say this person um, died in 1870. Yeah. Yeah. The land on which it stand was sold to a developer with a stipulation that the market been kept, marker been kept, not bulldozed and has been the fate of so many historic graves in Trinidad. This trust was kept and the tomb can be seen today where it is kept clean and painted by the Chinsami family. Many spirits are supposed to reside in the grave including a behatted Spaniard in black and a white woman with a child. The latter seems plausible since Mary Haynes, the wife of a manager of the estate, died in childbirth in the 1870s and presumably was buried nearby. Yeah. So this grave um, has been kept by Mr. Lincoln Blackman lives right at the side of the um tomb yeah yeah so anybody wish to um come visit the tomb yeah contact lincoln blackman on facebook yeah and yeah when i look coming if i want to bring a little token a little donation because this demand is um how the tomb looking clean and you know yeah so i right, hope that is the um and stay tuned for the catches. Yeah. yeah. Alright folks. Nice. So we come by Otaiti Fishing Depot here. 
And we come by a bridge with the name Owa. Beat man. Beat man. When you're driving the road here, straight ahead, this stall here. Yeah, boy, Owa. Yeah, boy. So, introduce yourself and tell the well, people themselves. I don't know Owa, the beat man. Yeah. Any kind of beat, all over, just come over put and all over again. Ask and for Owa. Joshua, I just ask for Owa. Any Owa. Any Owa. Yeah, but only one Owa. Right? So we're getting big up here with some nice big hair into Philly and putting them hook. We're going to deal with them today. Nice. We're going to hold fish, man. We're going to hold fish. We're going to Granville. What do you think about Granville? Yeah. I know they're holding some red fish down. Granville? Yeah. Oh. All right, all right. Yeah, man. So, yeah, folks, stay tuned. We can jam them today. Nice. All right, people. Um, yeah, on the way to Granville, you know, I had to wait for Lincoln a little, you know, a, a bit. So I just decided to stop out by Sunset Beach here. Yeah, this is Sunset Beach here, folks. This is on Reed Road Point 14. You know, a little quiet little village. You know, with a shed and some bench and table and yeah. And right off this little wall here, there's the ocean. Nice place to come and bring the kids, bring the family, chill out there, have a little picnic and cast a little line off these rocks here. You know? And yeah, and one thing all you could. You all notice the place clean, eh? Uh, this is how it should be. You know, people in Point Fortin. You know? Yeah, this is how people in Point Fortin is hardy vibes. The area looking anyway. I see a little one one cops, but yeah, yeah. So, these sunset beach on the left side, it's a little piece of shoreline there, a little rocky formation in a distance there. I'm going to drive down further down, and if I see any, any road on your right, I'll stop and check it out. Yeah, I'm trying to remember after sunset beach, it's about guy. In a road after Sunset Beach, I'm looking for um, contact on Messenger, but I am finding it. Yeah. yeah it had a time we did a little fishing out there. Me and Ninja Man, Jack Sparrow, and a few other guys. Yeah, we get some good fish and thing, but um, yeah. Well, anyway, let me keep going. Yeah, this is our road trip slash fishing, kayak fishing. Adventure. Yeah. Yeah, folks. Alright, so stay tuned. Alright, folks. Yeah, now after Sunset Beach, Chunkit Street. Yeah, that past three roads. See view one, two, and three. And our guy tell me to have a board walk inside this road. Never know that. So I'll check it out. Chunkit Street on Reed Road. You're passing um, Sunset Beach, Sea View 1, 2, and 3. And you'll come up to Chunkit Street. Yeah, so. Here you can see what boardwalk this guy talking about here. So we at Chunkit Street. Ready guys said it have a boardwalk by you see no boardwalk here. There are no board on this walk, they are driveway. Yeah. With some rocks packed along the coastline here. I guess this is the stop erosion. Yeah. Probably nice place to fish. Cast a line on high tide. Yeah. And there are some rocks out there, you know. My guy lippy and your little this and that out there. But it have a net set in the water. And 
Yeah, man. A nice, magnificent place to come visit. You know? Alright. Well, did the Bushman showcase in Trinidad? Inside out. Yeah. Yeah, folks, we are going to stick here too long. We still have many stops along the way to reach Granville. You know? Places that I never went before, been here before. Yeah. Side, folks. We're moving again. Yeah, folks, and further down Chunkit Street, the boardwalk. You know, didn't realize it had this little piece of inlet here, a little river going in with a check that day dry trees and coastline going down where the sea just taken back the land yeah hmm nice place to bring the kids and just chill out just you know right on these rocks here just man I telling you just to breeze out and spend the day you know yeah well anyway as I say, let me get going. Let me just stick in one spot too long. Yeah. Alright, folks. I'm sure after this vlog, it got people coming down here. You know? Just the sightsee, just for the drive, just to bring the family, and just take a walk alongside a stone walk. Right, I don't know about walk now. Last one more. Yeah. Alright. Stay tuned. <coughs> Alright, folks. Now reach Granville. Yeah, now. These dogs, them greeting me right now. Check them out. Hello. You my friend? Huh? You my friend? Come, come. Let me touch you. You my friend. Hello. I want big boy. Come, come. Alright then. I coming out. I coming out. No, they better don't bite me. Come. Hello. Alright, so this is the Granville Beach here. Find the place a little windy and thing. food are down look for them dogs eat man all right folks right so i'd gone well here now and i meet up a solia here come here come here come sit down next to the bush man yeah all of we is one family man so yeah i meet up a solia here where's his name call me blacks blacks suk de babwa you live down the side yeah i live right in Nice, nice. So, well, uh, as I tell you, I come to go out here with the kayak and fish. So, my right. boy here, go and give me a little, yeah, well, what I was telling a little something about the area. We just go outside here, right? Yeah. We just go with boat. Boat? Yeah. I mean, you always go far out. Yeah, if I can. Here we go. Yeah. Outside there, you have to know the banks and them. Oh, you have to know the banks. Mm -hmm. All right. You can go and drop in anywhere you would know not to. Alright. So you need to look for the stone. I see yeah. yeah. Which so which part of the I could go with a kayak? I won't go too far. Now we'll have to go outside it. Which side? Yeah. Outside. So when I go I'll go more up so? Yeah. Or in front of the beach house. Not too far. Ah, not too far. Where the brown water stop and you get in the can of the water. Uh -huh. Right there. Eh? Nice, nice. Alright, well, I'll hear it. We are gone. Well, here. You go hold, you go hold red fish. Red fish? Yeah. What about salmon? Yeah, you might hold one for salmon and fish. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's how they're feeding. Yeah. Alright, cool, cool. So, you catch crab? No, I ain't catching none. None, none, none? None, 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 none. Some crab, it's scarce. Crab are the cover you hold now. Oh, cover in hole. Mangrove or blue crab you come to catch? Blue crab. Oh, we had to set the trap. Yeah. Alright, alright. Nice, nice. Ah, 
trap. No. New trap. Mm -hmm. Alright, cool, cool. So I waited on my partner to come, Lincoln. Are we going out there? Yeah, see that? No nah, man. We gotta talk offline just now when I come off. Yeah, so the water gonna stay so for the day go get more rough a little later. Oh alright, alright. Wait, it's get real bad here sometime? Yeah, it's get real bad. Yeah, high high V but But these days it's yeah, not like that. Nah, Alright, alright. Yeah, yeah. Well my partner comment we going out as a team out there. Eh? And do something I'm still waiting for him. I don't know what time he leave home but but the formula remain. Lincoln. Yeah. Yeah. Hold on now, I'll come back to here. Yeah, so this is the um What's that place there boy? Washroom facility in Granville. Yeah. Well the last time I was here, the road did the paved part did a little more outside so you know they see coming and taking back some of the land. So yeah, I sure line to go all the way down. A peak there where I went a few years ago and fish off the peak. Yeah, people was catching some nice fish there. Lippy and rockfish now. So alright folks, stay tuned for when we go out there in the out day. Right? Nice. Alright, so me and uh Where is your name? I forget your name already. Sook de Babwa. Yeah, we went to Rio to get a little something there to eat and this and that. Come back here, you was get my spots to go out there now, so yeah. Yeah, but unfortunately, Sook de Babwa. Yeah, he, he had no place to live, live in a pavilion. So, anybody come down Granville and meet him, you know, big him up with a little something, you know. We are you no know, UL situation and things, so yeah, folks. Alright, so anyway, I'll ask you to stay tuned till we go out there. Yeah. Alright, folks. Alright, we are Grand Rill here, we home. See the bike, the pine tree. Type your hammock, and you're just chilling. Right now, I'm waiting for Lincoln to come. And I've seen the road there. And I ain't seen Lincoln yet. Yeah. Yeah, so I waited for Lincoln to come. <sighs> I tied my hammock and I way I could see the road there. Any vehicle coming down? Yeah. Well, actually, I'm supposed to be out on the water there since 6 o'clock. But first time going out there, I going out by myself. Yeah, I waited on Mr. Blackman to come. And then we got venti out. I was planning to go out early and come back by 10 11, but I go out after lunch and come back at evening time and see what we do. Yeah. Well, I have company there, but I'm still chilling with me. Yeah. So, um, stay tuned. Actually, a, a guy just drive in the car park and swing and gone back and hail me out from Granville area. I get his name. He, wife and he, child. Yeah, big up man. Big up, big up. <laughs> yeah. Well, anyway, well, let's stay tuned for the catches and, you know, the extreme adventure out there. Yeah. It's all right. All right, folks. Nice. So, why are we waiting for Lincoln? Lincoln ain't reached yet. Time. We're going with Mamu here. I could call you Mamu for short. Mm -hmm. Alright, we're going with Mamu here in the mangrove and check trap. I'll see what we get. We Mamu get right now, yeah. We catch is sell the crab to sustain now. A little, to, you know, to buy up little stuff. So, yeah. we heading into the bush. Yeah. So, there we go. <laughs> Yeah. Nice. At Granville. 
So stay tuned for when we reach in the crab field. Alright, alright, so we head in. Mamu tell me ride a ride a. The last time a man tell me ride a is half mile, mile and thing, you know. So, let me hope it's ride a. Because I have a Lincoln, oh, water, wet my shoe. I have a Lincoln, come there and then see me, you know. Whoa! Yeah. There are some birds feeding out there. I have high expectation out there, man, later. Yeah. We can have come back, the water reach quite up here, boy. I'm gonna take off my shoe. Yeah. All right, folks, so we nearly reached the traps. So, all you're getting to see what the crab, crab men is go through. You know, when a crab man call price for the crabs, you know? All right, our trap set there, but our trap ain't fly at all. All right, we are one trap set here, but this one, eh, that trap ain't fly. Yeah, they, they see the trap fly or it fly, you know. Nah. How much trap you have set in all? Twelve. Twelve? Okay. I make trap too, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know how to make them. I make trap and set on thing already. Mango tree here, boy. Yeah. What kind of mango tree that is there? Yeah. This one. That, that never be here, probably. Yeah, I never seen a mango. Oh, Alright, alright. You went back home, there's not a home home by you? Yeah, you went Oh, you went quite there? It's like the shop and I'm by Tell you what food. Oh. Alright. You get two cigarettes? Yeah. And buy a bread and you drink and you get so many. Yeah, yeah. You want to believe for you, no? How do you mean? You are no worries in life, eh? Mm -hmm. Free man. Mm -hmm. You're not going over the hill there in a flat piece later? Mm -hmm. No, I'm coming by a river. A river? Mm -hmm. Look at the river right there, man. Yeah, there's a river. What are river is happening? Both here, all kinds of things. Big ones or small? Medium one? Big ones, small ones, all kinds of things. All right. Crayfish. crayfish, yeah. Serious? Big ones? Mm -hmm. Yeah, crayfish, you see. Yeah. But how do you catch them? Hook. I, I, eh? Hook. Hook? I just catch crayfish with harpoon and head light up. Not. Mm -hmm. You little four sprung harpoon and head light. Nah. In the night you see them on the edge or something? Yeah, yeah they'll be on the edge of time. Is there fishing in them? Oh. Fishing in them, you say? It's fine hook there is thick? Yeah. With shrimp? Mm -hmm. 
using number four, number 16 hook. That you real fine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because the crayfish mode is small. Mm -hmm. And they're really taking that, you? Yeah. Yeah? All right. The bark here are real grounds, boy. Too small? Mm -hmm. Small for food. Yeah, they're small man. We check that piece of mangrove, river mangrove there. Mm -hmm. Do you like here? Let's get the crayfish to a hook? Yeah. Huh? Alright. Not Look at crab trap there. Wait. That fly? That whole trap? Mm -hmm. oh. Can you see that trap? Yeah. Not probably yeah, nothing. That I rest by no hole. Mm -hmm. No, that trap I rest by no hole. Crab already dead inside eh? Mm -hmm. Nothing. Nothing. Alright. Oh, the hole in front. Oh. Yeah. Nice. So we reach by our next trap here. This trap fly. Yeah, that one. Yeah, he did. He did. Put him in your bag? Yeah, just now. Yeah, I want to see him now. Just now, eh? Yeah. I catch two of them like this. But I'll make up with the lights. Yeah. Because that one is a nice size one. Yeah, Alright All right size. Oh yeah, it's wrapped them one time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I never see somebody wrapping crab in mm -hmm. Tying them up like how you're doing it now. Yeah. yeah. See that today. Nice. I'm not me alone go see. People far and wide go see it too. Huh? People far and wide. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, so the bushman here with a more bushman day. Yeah? Nice. When the, when the place open back hunting, you know the place on lockdown. Mm -hmm. When the place open back hunting, I am not going to cause anything to come and bust out here and put Come now, my new man, I will bring around to that thing. We got to be good for my head, you know? Mm -hmm. We got to bring a little duck, a little this, that, you know? Yeah. We got to organize here. Yeah. Okay. Let's see if I see foot by the time. Inside here. Hold on, there's something to see him. So they run away now. Hey, press him down. Run away and go away. They run down that hole. But you, you think if you bring a fork and you dig you'll get them faster? Yeah, you could dig and cook and them out. Yeah. So, the, 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 so we're watching the technique here, how the, the fold the foot. Oh no. I just don't know obscene language on my video now. I got ah, your bitch, your bike. Yeah, I gotta edit that out. You grab ya? Mm -hmm. I will kill you ass. Then yeah. I go lost. The only thing when you kill him, um, people have all that grab. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He's strong, boy. Yes, sure, now that's nice. Alright, I see now to do that, man. Me and his catch crab and pull off the back one time. He's pull off the back. Yeah, he's pull off the back. I is move with slingshot and headlight. Mm -hmm. In night and bust them before they go in the hole. Yeah.
Yeah, folks, and that's how you check a trap. Catch your crab and tie it up. Nice. Stay tuned for the next trap. Right, and this is how you set back the trap now. Yeah, folks, I had a video some 150, 60 video back where I set my trap and catch and thing. So, uh, most of the new subscribers wouldn't really um, look back on that and check it out. So, this is a new and updated one. Crabbing. Bamboo? Yes, so Mamu now telling me here, Mamu is a professional welder, you know. Mamu used to work Kita serve the company where he shipped food offshore and thing. Man used to build the food container and thing for them and you know. But you see as age 62 year, you know. As they get old, you know, yeah, yeah, able and thing and you see people want to hire him because they see he ready to dead. You see? Yeah, yeah, three years again to collect your um, your thing, man. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But you're healthy, you know, ailment and thing, eh? Yeah. Right, right, that's the most important thing. Mamu healthy, you know, ailment and thing. So, yeah. So, anyway. You yeah, some parrots in the forest here. Yeah. Real parrots. Yeah. See some woodpecker in a distance. I know the camera can't pick it up, but nice piece of forest here. Mm -hmm. Nice. So another trap here. We check a few traps. There fire. Nice. Yeah, this one day. So let me see where this one having him. How big he is or what? And we have a little stream here. Nice. Mamu see these streams have. Monster crayfish. Yeah, but have a technique to catch them. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, man. Idi idi. For a sun off shrink, <laughs> shrink are done. Yeah. I went up to them. My tell me to go back and check them trap here. Oh, you see? Well, you still come back and you catch two. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And you said that this morning when I meet you there. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Yeah. You come back here for the day when you set this? No. Yeah. Good morning. You see? Hey, nice one, boy. That's a nice one. Set here for the day. Yeah. Lucky. Lucky small gun did it first. Yeah. They're moving there again. Huh. Lock the small one, hold the big one. We have to the string now. Long the string. Look at it. Ready, ready, in front here. Yeah. You see when you tie it, so see you lock the big one, did you know? Yeah. You shove it between the big claw and you start to wrap. Mm -hmm. Oh. Can open back again. Easy technique, you know? Mm -hmm. I always thought it was hard, you know? Very easy way. What are you doing? Yeah, you fighting here. Yeah. Just hold them foot on. Hold them foot. Yeah. Yeah, hold them foot there. Right. Hold them right there. Yeah. Right, let go.
How much are now? One, two. How much are home? Two. Two, and you catch two. Okay, four. Four. One and you have, again. you have more trap to check? Yeah. How much? How much so? Three trap again. Three. Far from here? No, uh, just across the river. Oh, yeah, yeah. If you go and check down, get out tight and check link on there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Don't worry, where you catch here? Yeah? Come down with the crab. When I come out of the water, I go pay for your crab. Right? Oh, you have order? I have order. Oh, shucks now. Well. <laughs> you have to fulfill your order first. I don't see, I don't see. Where do you want it? My daughter. Like oh. crab. Yeah. But anyway, I don't see. I just catch my crab, do you know? Mm -hmm. I mean, up Karani. Mm. If I go up Karani, I catch in. Eat 10, 12 crab, quick, quick, but I won't catch them alive to wrap them and sell them like how you think now. I catch them. I use. thing. Where are the thing for inside here? Look, look at it, look at it. Nah. You know it? Nah, let me eat. Alright. Alright, so we don't catch crab and. Reach back out on the shoulder here and tie the rays. Almost full. And Mamu here going and see if he catch a cigit. Siric cigit. Yeah. Big one. Massive one he says he's catch here. So I don't know if we could be successful. There's be right on the edge. That river. Black day boy like it. Ah oh, yeah, 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 get one boy. Small one. You're <laughs> yeah, you're really good enough. Yeah. Let's hold them there. Hey yo. Watch out daddy. It's a warrior boy mamu. Less than two minutes, see man say if I will see him catch that one in this. Man catch it already. Yeah. Nice little spot here to chill out and relax. Check it out. Type a hammock there, you throw your line out there and just chill. Alright, so yeah, more than half day going good so far. Yeah, so let we go. Oh. Nice, so stay tuned. Alright folks, we reach the destination. Ready to let go out line now. Anchor. Shallow waters. Too shallow. Hmm. Water's so shallow. Yeah folks, so out here. My partner Lincoln say he come out for a little while only catfish, catfish, catfish. So I know if I go hook up something better. Uh, two line out in the water here, but actually here real shallow. 
Yeah. I about half mile to three quarter mile out here and it's real shallow. I wonder if I could get it there for this paddle, boy. Let's see if I get it there for this paddle. Nah, it's it about 10 feet here. Yeah, about 10 feet deep probably. And I'm so far out. Huh, imagine that. And rain coming. But I don't think it'll fall too hard. But anyway, the tide starting to fall in a while. A guy say falling tide is the best tide to fish here, so... Let me hear, let me see what's going on. Yeah. Nice. Daddy Gilbaka, we are talking about the Chai Gilbaka. Cool and ray flavor. Yes, use a nice one. I will let go back here, partners then. Nice, so we had my man like Lincoln coming in here. Hey, hey, Mr. Man? Black Man, boy. All you gonna know, he that the man who pulled the ancho. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so one time we had a big up Lincoln here. Tell them what you do. Air condition. Repair. Service, repair, install of any brand at a reasonable price. No work too big, no work too small. Yes. Yes. Well, you can call me at 322 1998. Right. So, all you call the man, don't let me do this in vain. Call the man, work slow right now. You know? So, yeah, so we come out here to get some big ones. And other than work, this is what we love. Yes, yes, this is, so, this is the passion. You know? This is why we're out here. Yeah, we come out here, we are catching nothing, we're happy still. Yes, all the time. Yeah, yeah. So, stay tuned for the big jam in a while. Yeah. Nice, we are Mr. Blackman Day with a rack and do. First best fish for the day, so like things will get nice. Pull it up there. Nice, nice. Nice rack and do in the house there. So with the rack and do the salmon there must be there too. Yeah. So we get in through. I catch a nice size gilbaka, about two pong. Yeah. All right, so we are Mr. Black one day on his second rakando. I on my first gilbaka, and the vibe is just nice out here. No wind, yet the water a little wavy, but real nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Looking, them rakando looking different, boy. Can clean. All right, all right, nice. So we gain two. When I go on show, I'll get a better footage and we catch. Yeah. All right, man, like Lincoln, come on, I'll put something nice there. Thing, right? Catfish. Rakando. Let me hope it's a nice fish. Yeah. Come in, come in, man. Visual. Big Rakando. Big salmon. Big gilbaka. Oh, good. 
Hey, boss. You see it? You see the fish? No Ow. Yeah, people, that is happening sometimes. That one hurt. Way. That hurt, yeah. Way. It feel like no catfish? No, no, no catfish, right? It's not, it's not stingy. That good fish, that could be a salmon or a big reds. Way. Hmm. That one is a Why? Me what happened to me, nah? We in a good zone here, I think? Yeah, yeah, that, that's how it is. That is how it is be, yeah, folks. That is how it is be. Gotta expect that. Nice. Next, next jam we gotta bring it in. Hmm. Only Kiatos in the house. All right, folks. Yeah. Um, well, not ready to leave Granville. Minutes past six, and hope you all enjoy the vlog. The place by um, Sunset Beach, where the boardwalk, the crab catching part, and the fishing. And well, in our next video, I'll do a catfish menu. Real best way to prepare catfish, gourmet style meal. I'll do that by itself, so look out for that video, right? So, move on out and yeah, keep good, folks.